Hi guys, this is Dr. Denny Warren with Generations Health and Wellness Center, and I wanted to share some research from the Journal of, let's see, the Journal of Alternative and Complementary Medicine. Now I want to give you a little bit of background about this because I have some personal uh, influence or personal information about this. Now, when President Bill Clinton was in office, he put together a complementary alternative medicine board where they could go and start to evaluate all these different types of care for people. Because what they found in the public, more and more people were searching for alternatives besides just taking medicine all the time. Because they saw that medicine, although it was really good and really effective for emergencies, it just wasn't getting people healthy. So more and more people were starting to turn towards alternatives and complementary type care to help get their body healthy and well. Well, one thing that's interesting, when Bill Clinton put this together, my father, who is a dentist, his name is Dr. Don Warren, or Donald Warren in Clinton, Arkansas, he was the only dentist that was on that White House board. So I have, I have a lot of neat history with this. But this journal is very interesting. So the, the title of this was Unanticipated Benefits, I'm reading right here off the computer, Unanticipated Benefits of CAM Therapies, which CAM, again, is Complementary Alternative Medicine Therapies for Back Pain, an exploration of patient experiences. So here's what they did is they, they looked at um, people that received different complementary alternative medicine type treatments, and they wanted to see what was the full range of full scope of benefits. They saw people that got better with their back pain was better, the neck pain was better. They had different things, ailments or symptoms were better. But here's some other things that they found. Let's see, our analysis identified a range of positive outcomes that participants in CAM therapy trials considered important, but were not captured by standard quantitative outcome measures. Here's some of the things they found. Positive outcome themes included increased options, increased options and hope, increased ability to relax, positive changes in emotional states, increased body awareness, changes in thinking that increase the ability to cope with back pain, increased sense of well-being, increase in physical conditions unrelated to back pain, that's nice, increased energy, increased patient activation, they're becoming more active, and dramatic improvements in health or well-being. And there's a small fraction of these were even considered life transforming type changes. So when you, if you're new to chiropractic, if you never had it, just understand that chiropractic is not just about treating symptoms, it's not about treating back pain. It's about helping you express your full genetic potential. It's about helping you be truly well and healthy and vital. And it's pretty cool to see that these research, so some of the research that my dad was actually on the board of the complementary alternative medicine, the research that they're finding now is that's the exact side effect of these type of treatments, of chiropractic care, is helping you be vital, full of energy, full of hope, helping things improve in your body, helping your emotional state improve, increase body awareness. That's what we're about. We're about helping you increase your expression, have a better quality of life. So if you have questions about this, if you want a better quality of life, better expression, call our office. We'd love to help you out. I hope this helps. Hope you helps you understand a little bit more about what we do. But have a great day, and we'll see you in the next video.